In this video I'm going to show you how you can easily save a web page as a PDF document in Safari on an iPhone or iPad. Be sure to watch the video to the very end so you don't make any mistakes. Let's get started guys, I'm gonna show you all the process from the beginning and uh, first off we need to open up Safari and then head over to a web page we want to save as a PDF. After that all you have to do is just tap right here at share and then tap add print. That will generate a PDF document. Uh, it is already ready to be printed. However, we won't print that. We just uh, will save it later. But before that, I'm going to show you how we can adjust it. First off, we can uh, in here change orientation from portrait to landscape. In that way, I just switch the orientation. Also, we can deselect some pages. The web page has been automatically split into that pages. And that's how we can deselect them to not add them to our PDF document. Also in here we can change scaling. We can reduce it or increase it just by tapping at that buttons here in that way and uh, once it is done and you are ready to save that document all you have to do is just tap add share and then save to files after that select a folder in which you would like to save it i'm just gonna save it on my iphone in here we can change uh, in here we can change our documents title and then uh, we can just tap it save to save it now I'm gonna show you how we can find that document I'm gonna use files app that is official Apple application to manage files on the on our particular device and in the iCloud if we get into files and then if we head over to a folder in which we've saved the recent file we can easily find that PDF document here. We can open it up. As you can see, uh, the web page has been successfully saved as PDF. And after that, we can, let's say, uh, download this PDF to computer. Or we can, let's say, send it to someone via some messenger. I'm going to use Telegram just to demonstrate you. Uh, if we head over to some conversation, we can tap at that paper clip here. And then if we select files, we'll be able to select that PDF, hit add open, and that will upload that PDF document to uh, that particular conversation. Uh, let me just wait for a couple of seconds until it is done. And once it is done, it, it uh, is already sent to that conversation, as you can see, so we can open it up in that way. That's how you can easily save a web page as a PDF and send it to someone. If this video was helpful for you, don't forget to hit the like button.